Hide some cables in my pockets. Cable management, story of my life, so it seems. Welcome everybody to the channel. This is the Future Space Collective, where we explore the world of products for imagination. So it's 2020 now, and a lot of us are creating workspaces and home setups for conferencing, for recording, for a variety of work-related projects, for communicating, voice calls, all of the like. So now that everybody is sort of building out their home offices into little mini studios, the core of all this is having good sound, having a good microphone. So I wanted to find an excellent microphone that is easy to use, that can just plug into your computer via USB, that sounds great and is of professional quality, and I think we found that mic today. Let's check it out. So today we are taking a look at a microphone company called Fifine. Fifine, 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 I don't know, F-I-F-I-N-E. Fifine, fine, let's just, okay. So it's the, it's the Fifine, or maybe it's Fifany, could be Fifany. Fifine recording USB microphone, the T669. Okay, so listen, if you guys need a very simple microphone for podcasting, voice conferencing, you wanna get into YouTube, do YouTube videos, whatever the case may be, we might have found an all-in-one solution within this package here that really ticks all the boxes. So this is what we're looking at upon first opening our box here. So we can see there's a user's guide, little promo card. Okay, first thing we see here, so this. So for those of you at home who don't know what this is, this is called a pop screen. Now what this is used for is to prevent the audio recording from popping your P's or T's. So by putting this in front of the microphone while it's recording and talking through it, it's gonna prevent all those P's and T's from being and, and creating that sound. That's gonna remove this. This is what we're looking at with all of the accessories in the package here. So it comes with a shock mount. It comes with a microphone, another sort of pop screen. It comes with a USB cable. It comes with a microphone arm, as you see, which is really interesting. Um, it comes with the clamp to clamp it to your desk, the arm, the microphone, the shock mount to hold the microphone. And it also comes with what look like alien antennas. No, I, I think this is just a little tripod if you'd like to not mount the microphone, but you wanna just have it on your table. So. They've really thought out this whole package here with everything that they give you. They give you absolutely everything you could want for a microphone accessory. These are rubber strings for the, um, replacement rubber strings, I guess, for the microphone shock mount right here. So we've got a ton of stuff here. So let's take it all out of the box. Here's the microphone arm right here. Spring loaded. You know, I have a really good feeling about this product. It's so feature packed. They literally give you everything you need in a kit. I mean, if you were to go and buy all of this stuff, you know, and get like really high end stuff, you would be buying all these pieces separately. You'd be buying the pop screen separately, you'd be buying the arms separately, um, you know, clamps, tripods. None of this stuff typically comes, not to mention the fact that professional microphones, they don't. Not to mention a regular microphone usually has a XLR output, which is an analog format. But this, what makes this particular microphone special is the fact that it actually has, for lack of a better term, a sound card inside the microphone that takes the signal that is our analog voice talking, the sound waves coming out of our body, that are being captured by the microphone and it's turning that into a digital signal all within the microphone. So you can simply plug it into your computer with USB and you don't have to deal with audio IOs or you know more elaborate mixers or sound cards such as the professionals use. So that's why this is a very interesting kit here because it seems like a great way to get up and running for somebody who's just starting out but really wants to up their audio game a little bit. So let's assemble this thing a little bit. I am very curious, I wanna try out the arm here. So 
So we're gonna take the clamp here, we're gonna unclamp it. You guys at home can see what I'm doing if you wanna pick one of these up and see how to set it up. To put the clamp in, we're gonna take this, um, the black piece here, and that just, you insert that into the hole, slides in like that, then you can tighten it up. This is just going to clamp onto your desk or your table, and now you can rearrange it if you wanna move it like that. There are also knobs here. You can loosen the knobs if we wanna move and adjust it and then tighten it up. I do like that feature. We're gonna move this a little bit forward actually. Something like this. So, you know, the arm is pretty intuitive. Just using it for the first time, you can kind of get it where you want it. If you did want to use the shock mount, you know, I've, I've used a lot of microphones in my days. If you do want to use the shock mount, this being the shock mount, you unscrew the bottom there. We're gonna, we're gonna put this through here and then we're gonna screw it back in like so. And then we can just attach this, this piece here. Everything just kind of screws together. Probably should have screwed this in before attaching the mic, but there we have it now. Okay, so I wanna put my mic, assuming the front is this way. You can also put this on top of it, an extra little windscreen protector here from obscuring any sounds or, or whispers. This protects from any air, getting to the microphone and kind of messing up the recording. And then again, if you wanna go one step further, we can put on the pop screen here. The pop screen is another little clamp that I'm guessing we can just clamp into our arm here. All right, look at that, guys. Woo! So this is a really fully featured kit, as you can see here. Let's actually plug this thing in and give it a go first time around. Like I said, it also has a tripod if you just wanna connect it to there. This is another way to connect the microphone if you wanna use the tripod. Let's test this thing out. Let's, let's plug in the USB cable and uh, see how difficult it is to connect, okay? I'm gonna grab my laptop. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna record my laptop screen so you guys can see what I'm doing here. So I'm gonna plug the microphone in for the first time. I have no idea what's gonna happen. This is a Windows laptop. So let's test out and see what happens. So we plugged in the microphone. As you can see, Windows is simply just says setting up a device. We're setting up your USB audio device. All right, there we go. Now our device is ready to roll. Okay, so after a relatively painless setup, I basically just plugged in the microphone into my Windows laptop here. It automatically installed the driver and it automatically showed up as an input device on my computer. So now I'm recording on my laptop and let's give it a test, shall we? So now I'm just talking into my lavalier mic right now. And now you're gonna hear what it sounds like through this microphone. Test one, two, now I'm now talking through this microphone and you can, as I would assume, hear a huge quality difference in talking into a large diaphragm condenser microphone like this versus the lavalier microphone, which is obviously a less superior way of capturing audio, but of course we don't have this monstrosity microphone in our shot. So back to this microphone. So I'm assuming this microphone is sounding pretty good right about now, pretty buttery smooth. I mean, look at it. it, it comes with all the pieces you need. It literally, it comes with everything at such a great price point. This is one of the most inexpensive microphones that I found here on the market um, that really kind of checks all the boxes and makes it super simple for anybody to get started with podcasting, um, you know, conference calls, you're doing this, you're doing Zoom chats now, you're working remotely, you're having meetings. This is a great microphone. There's a dial on the actual microphone itself as well, and you can control the input audio level with this dial. But yeah, this is what it's sounding like. Hopefully it's sounding good to you guys. I am super curious to check it out myself. Okay guys, so now I've unplugged the microphone. We're back on my lav mic. Um, but you know, I really don't have any bad things to say about this setup. I mean, for the cost of it, I'm absolutely mind blown. I'm, I gotta tell you, like I've been in the audio world for, for quite a number of years. I've studied a bit of audio engineering and sound design. For the price, that's what's really getting me. You know, you can check the updated pricing in the descriptions below, but it's the price that's getting me of how cheap that it comes with all of these accessories here 
and the tripod if you'd rather here let me let's let me show you the tripod here if you did want to i mean if you did want to use this you can totally not use the shock mount if it if it gets in the way you don't like it you don't have to you can also use this piece that's already screwed onto the tripod right here. But this piece that I'm spinning also can attach to the arm if you would prefer to use that. But I just wanted to show you guys quickly how you can also use it as a little tripod as well. You just feed it back through and screw it back in like so. And there you go. Plug it back into the bottom here. Look, they even give you a little cable tie, a little Velcro cable tie. Love those, I use a ton of those everywhere. This is the sort of volume, it's not really volume, but a volume input knob on how loud you want the microphone to be, which is great. Yeah, if you just wanna have it on your desk, you can. It even came with a little tripod. So I absolutely love this little microphone. I, I think it's great. I would highly recommend it if you are in the market to start a creative project of your own that requires audio and you don't, you don't know too much about audio, you don't wanna get too complicated with it. You're just looking for something simple that provides you all the starting points to get going. I really think this microphone is an excellent, excellent option. You've heard the sound tests, you've seen it. I don't know what else to say. Go, go pick one up if you need it, try it out, return if you don't like it. But honestly, what's not to like about this microphone? It's, it's awesome, I gotta say. I will, I will recommend it to anybody looking for a microphone of this nature who's not too tech savvy and that just wants a starting point to get into this world of multimedia, really. If you like the channel idea, if you wanna help support the channel where we explore the world of products for imagination, that is art, decor, lighting, smart home technology to help bring your space into the future, please hit that subscribe button, comment, like the video, engage with the video. It all helps to grow the channel. And if the channel grows large enough, we can start making more entertaining videos. We can bring larger ideas to life. So help me out here, engage with the video. All right, we'll see you in the next one. That's, that's you, because you should be talking into the screen because you have something to say.